Hi folks, it's Miranda from Miranda Has Plans, and I'm here to plan with you for the week of October 12th to 18th. And here's what the page looked like before I attacked it. It looked like this. Which, because it's October and I'm doing everything Halloween, this doesn't scream Halloween to me. I don't know what's pink about Halloween, so... Going with my color palette for the month of black, orange, purple, green, and white. I decided to go over everything with purple. Because I have a great idea in mind. And I've had this idea since back before I was a creative diary girl and I was a happy planner girl. I had this spread not really totally figured out. But I knew what I wanted to do. So I've covered everything with purple. Next thing I want to do is plot out my days. So even though you can still see some of the stuff that was underneath here, I'm totally fine with that because it adds texture to the picture and everything. So I'm good. And I didn't cover this that well because I wanted all these little kind of covered bits in there again for texture. What I'm going to do, though, since everything is purple, is instead of playing my days all on this page, I'm going to play in all the way across. So, what I'm going to do is grab my trusty dusty ruler, and I'm going to go along the top and just mark every two inches but i'm gonna start one inch in okay and those are going to be my days so what does that give me monday tuesday wednesday here do i want to go one inch in the middle again hmm i don't know I think maybe what we'll do is we'll go one inch from that last one and then do the two inches. So we'll have a little gap that kind of runs down the middle of the page. So that's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And then Sunday goes all the way to the edge. All right, that's our pencil marks. So what I want to do is I'm going to take my Posca paint pen. This is the skinny one. I want the chubby one. So I'm going to use the chubby one. And all I'm going to do is draw a straight line down Let's see, I think I'm going to stop about seven inches because that'll leave me all this to do. Do I want that much? Maybe I'll stop about six inches. So it's a little bit more than half, which was going to leave me a bunch of room to decorate down here. Is that what I want? I think maybe instead of, I'm going to leave a gap there. Saturday and Sunday are going to be together in their row. So I am going to go down to seven inches. All right. So I went through, measured out my lines, divided Saturday and Sunday in half, and then I made a little gap up here so I can put the days there. And I've got to decide how I want to write in here. Because I think the purple is a little too dark. Alright, so I decided I'm going to paint some boxes in my days. I can't use Dilution's paint, though. The white is a little too see-through. 
So what I'm going to use is my Liquitex Gesso, which is super white. And if it doesn't come out as white as I want, I can always go over it again. So what I did was I cut a little hole the size that I need. And I'm going to go through and put those in my columns. Alright, so I went through and I did my little boxes and I got some white smudges everywhere. When you do that, just go back over with your background color and cover it up. Easy peasy. No big whoop. I like this box that I messed up. I can fix it up a little. Going over it with more of my background color. Alright, those look really, really bad right now, but trust me, it'll get better. So, I think... I don't want to white, uh, write on those white parts right now. But what I am going to do is really sloppily put a border around them. That makes them stand out a little bit. Oh, I missed one. How'd that happen? Okay, that makes them stand out a little bit and look really cute. I haven't decided if I'm going to stamp the days up here or just put the, um, just put a letter. I'm still thinking about that. So, the next thing I want to do is get out my black paint. I am seriously weighing these pages down with paint this week. And I'm okay with that. I don't like having to waste the paint I put in here, but I squeezed too much out and that's my own fault. Oh Lord, I should have been named Marvin because I am nothing but a mess. Good grief. All right, so we're going to, where did I put that? Change this. And we're going to shake up our black. Do I want to use this? I don't know if I can open it today. <clears throat> I have issues with uh, fibromyalgia, which gives me some serious muscle weakness from time to time. So, opening things is somewhat hard. So, now I need to find one of my bottles, which are way easier for me to open, but they didn't have this kind of black when I bought that. So, and I use up, like, I let these dry when I use them. I don't throw these away until like, they start falling apart or fall off my little thingy here because why waste? the money right so here's what I'm gonna do all along here we're going to paint some black but I want to do it in a shape here a little Halloween scene down here. Won't that be cute? Look! Oh my gosh, it looks so pretty! Alright, so I'm going to put this away. Then I'm going to get me a paintbrush. I want a thin one. The thinnest one I can find. 
I don't know. I like the tip on this one best. We're going to use our paint. Paint some creepy trees. Alright, so I made this little seam down here. Um, all I'm going to do is go in, I think, and write in the days of the week up here, along with the date, which is the 12th through 18th. Then I'm going to see what I have for... Let's see. I think I'm going to put the word October over here on the side. What else do I want to put in here? I think it's super cute. I like it. It's not everything I had wanted it to be, but, you know, for flying by the seat of your pants, I don't think it's too bad. I wish I had drawn my little trick-or-treaters a little better, but, you know. We'll always find things wrong with our work, won't we? We gotta get better at being happy with what is. All right, so let's write in what we've got planned for this week so far. I have the 15th is my niece Jessica's 17th birthday. And I have a class with Diane on Sunday. All right. I don't know what else I'm going to do to this page. I think I am going to let it sit for a little bit. And I am probably going to doodle with it all week long. Let me put the 12th here. 12 through 18. And then I'm going to share pictures, especially in after the pen of this. On my Instagram page which is at Miranda has plans so if you liked what you saw please subscribe please hit the bell so you get notified whenever I post give me a thumbs up and remember don't be afraid to get creative in your creative diary this isn't going in a museum the Smithsonian's not going to want to see what you did this week this is totally for you do what makes you happy and be brave about it.